Hello, in this video I will show you what is it short codes. So let's go to short codes and add new short code. Name it as you want. So what we can do now, if you want to use any filter categories, we have to select it. Just now we want to use only taxonomies. You need to check this checkbox. We want to use auto submit, show count, hide empty items, reset bound, reset button, show found items count text, filter button text, filter it, post type product to manage by taxonomies of the selected post types. You should press update button. Okay, let's do it. Let's look what we want to use, product categories and color, a lot of be they, check boxes, sort panel, select panel, short code from skin, you can create your own skin and uh, customize it and use it with your them. How to create it is described in how to, how to create custom skin for search at coding, read it. So, just now we have all to use it. Let's press update. Mm, we can copy short code or here or here. This doesn't matter. Let's copy it. G create any tester page, drop it there, update. View page. Okay, what we have now, <clears throat> one single short code on the page. For example, it can work with such context. This short code can be dropped in your text, in your blog, and the user can, the user can uh, for example, if he is interested in something, uh, select options and filter it. In this case, you have to uncheck how to submit. Hmm, nothing found. Yes, let's try again. It will be five posters. Yes, that's all. Five posters. Simply posters and uh, and with color doesn't exist. That's right. Okay, but if you want to make filtering on the same page, and I can tell you more with a jazz. Just now, let's try without a jazz. Let's go uh, here and write result output. Boot page link self template self custom search text for choice result uh, by default it's found uh, found how many items custom to set link self set after submit I'll show example with JJX later on the same video update let's go to our documentation and look at this code, uh, short code, MDF products. Let's copy it. Copy, go to text, tester page. MDF products, column 4, order date, uh, order by date, order disk. You can set here title or something. Uh, per page, uh, page one, per page, pagination, top, bottom. Okay, and let's line with here, update. Update. Okay, let's try it. Works, here it is. Okay, but what about if I want to use range slider? I want to filter by slider. In such case, you have to uncheck this checkbox and select and select uh, filter category. And by the way, you can set by drag and drop 
uh, taxonomy on the top update a reset place here yes look we can use it by the way you you maybe can tell me uh, I don't want when color is under pro, uh, product category, categories now the pro, not problem create your own short code scheme and use it mm. so you can uh, create it as red with any layout but for this you have to know okay says uh, okay so let's check it yes it works pagination works okay but what about if i want to use a JAX. I have to go to the short code, uncheck after submit and check AJAX after account and AJAX items output. Update. But nothing works else. Because if I want to use AJAX, I have to drop this short code into special short code and MDF results by AJAX. Let's go. Let's copy it. go here okay look i just drop it this short code but it has attributes short code we i drop it short code without without this square um, forget how does it name in english <laughs> sorry and we have products columns for page nine pagination tb mean top and bottom if b bottom if only t top so i think it's clear now update let's go to tester oh sorry let's oh, that's not right sorry. okay let's test it green Mm. That's all. That's all right. But when I select something, for example, green animation going on the top, but I want let the animation going to the products. Um, let's look. Uh, when you using a JAX, you will always have such ID and diff results by JAX. So let's copy it. You can remember it simply and look animate target body so animate it works zero doesn't work animate target body animate target set as our id Re uh, refresh page <laughs> it's even an uh, animation even work when uh, the page uploads so let's check it yes that works reset sorry one thing i forget to tell you when you're using reset this field must be empty update okay what yes two reset yes it's all resetted again oh it's better use eight per page uh no eight yes eight eight refresh page yes it's more beauty works let's sort by price sending that works that's okay and this is all works okay just now i want to show you one interesting trick for example you want something as a demo when uploading from the right slide out search form how to do this so if we go to the documentation open article using short codes 
go to the same bottom, you can see, uh, read please, how to use. And you can see that short code search form has additional parameters, additional attributes. So, for example, if I want to use slide out, I have to copy this attribute, go to our test page, attribute, and just set it, slide out one, update, and one more thing, go to the, our short code and select here, scheme, slide out, it's already optimized for this model, ok, so let's refresh, what we can see here, Yes, we can see here our forms, search form, <laughs> very convenient thing. It's open and closed by button. But uh, one thing, I want when page reloading first time, uh, the search form must be slide out and must be opened. OK, let's look at our documentation. Action, click, hover, location, uh, location. Oh, we can set it on the left, location. And oh, on load, slide out, on load, slide out. That's mean when page will be loading. It will appear. Let's refresh the page and look. Here it is, but one thing, when we are using slide out short code, we don't need to use animate, we don't need it simply. Let's set animate zero. A refresh page, here it is, very super convenient thing. Okay, uh, let's look what we have. Uh, right or left, it's understand, right or left, click or hover, action, by default it's click, but we can set hover, when we hover it, it's opening, uh, ok, and fix it position, let's try it, but remember, it doesn't work with all of them correctly, uh, because of KSS styles, fix it position, what does it mean? Look at it. Here it is, if you understand what I mean. So, if your search for not very big and you have, for example, on per page enough products, uh, which height is more than uh, search form height, you can use uh, this option, fixed position. So, I think that's all about short codes. Nothing, something difficult. I hope you understand all. See you. Goodbye.